G'day and welcome to our weekly YouTube fishing report brought to you by Trally's Tackle World Geelong and Trally's Tackle World Laverton. Bit of rough weather over the last week has led to anglers fishing all the land-based structures around the bay with St Leonard's really on fire at the moment. Yeah, it's been a great opportunity for the land-based anglers to get stuck into some of this whiting action. Uh, casting out from St Leonard's Pier of an evening, they've been finding whiting to 40 centimetres, sometimes even a little bigger, with uh, most anglers achieving about 10 whiting in a session, which is really good. There's also been the odd salmon and pinky too. Fresh squid's the best bait. And there's been some nice squid in there on the inside side of the pier there as well. Barwon River's another one that's been standing out for the land-based angler. Mullet, salmon, trevally and brim have been the feature down there, with guys going to the effort to pump bass yabbies and fresh worms having the most success and those whiting are still going really well around Queenscliff. The salmon along the coast have been great. Into Corio Bay, there's been some good fish. Yeah, plenty of uh, Australian salmon holding from Rippleside right through to the entrance of the Grammar School Lagoon. Just look for the birds working of the surface commotion and cast plastics into the mix. When they're not on the surface, you'll just find them holding deeper end structure along the waterfront and just put a plastic right in front of their face and you'll catch them. Onto the fresh water, really starting to fire with a bit of rain we've had over the last week or so. The wordy redfin out at Word of Bullock have been a feature with guys still getting those fish between 40 and 50 centimetres. Entice vibes have been a bit of a standout, just cast out long and slow rolled back. They have been producing some quality fish over the last week or so. Moving on to Wendaree, there's some trout and reddies going up there as well. Yep, plenty of nice uh, trout going at Wendaree. Um, some impressive uh, rainbow trout, which is good to see. And uh, they're coloured up for the uh, sporting season. Just casting bobbin spoons and shallow diving lures is the trick there. And Chris has been up to you can be to chase those spawn run trout, which I think he'd like to tell you about. Yep, the spawn run trout's in full swing at you can be. Uh, just using glow bugs and nymphs, you probably can't see them there, is the way to go. And yeah, fish to two and a half, three kilo. It's something to see. And uh, just remember to be polite and courteous when you're up there, as it is a very busy spot. Moving on to the specials this week, we've got the Shimano X-Age 6000 and 10,000. Now, this is a great all-round size reel. It's perfect for snapper, gummies, light surf. You could even cast a stick bait for those smaller tuna and kings with this reel. These were $199. These are going to be run out this week for $79. So if you need a... A quality mid-range reel, this is the one for you. Come and check it out. We also have to help you into the Shimano comp. Four Shimano squid jigs for $50. So come in, check this out. That's the classic 61T jig. They're a great one for the local squid. Another special for this week is the Daiwa rods, which we're going to be doing at 20% off. That's all Daiwa rods, 20% off. Includes Battler rods, uh, Saltiga rods, we even got the, the deep drop stuff, so there's plenty to choose from. Light spin. That's a massive saving this week. Now, don't forget the May Tiagra comp, which is you come in, you spend $50 on Shimano or $500 store wide to go in the draw for this awesome Tiagra combo, which will be drawn on the 28th of May at 12 noon. Have to be in store, so come in to get to enter that. That's a fantastic comp and it was huge last year, so come in and check it out. That's it for this week. We'll see you on the water. Catch ya.